All right, Shalom, Shalom. This is your brother Shemak. I want to first start by giving all the glory, if and the praises unto Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rechah Kadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of great millstone who teach with wedding over his tabernacle of David. Shalom to the sincere Akim, pushing his teaching truth across all corners of the earth and giving all their diligence to do so. I just want to go into the uh, topic of our power being recognized. Okay, as the picture you see here with the brothers in uh, GMS Savannah down there to the earth in Savannah, Georgia. With the brother Yannakar on the left and the brother Husha on the right. Okay. And basically what happened, with basically what the encounter was, it was a short encounter with a uh, you know, an outer appearance of a so-called white man, you know. But um basically it was about what was said, you know, it was about what was said. So basically the encounter consisted of uh the man first coming up, you know, mentioning that hey, it takes power to be out here. You know, because I watched it and you can hear he said it pretty low, but you can still hear it. You know, but he said it takes power to be out here. And then, um, you know, he asked 30 seconds later, he asked about uh, is there more is there more of this I can find online? And of course, the brothers gave, you know, GMS Savannah, you know, gave him the YouTube page where you can find it. Because, hey, man, this power, this our power, we have power, man. It's being recognized. And then he later he later said uh, before he walked off, like that was like it was a short encounter. just like a two minute conversation. You know, he he let, he said, "Hey, bless you all, and may the Lord keep you." You know, cause he 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 felt he felt the strength out there, man. He felt the control in the spirit. He felt the dominion, cause we, that's what we looking for, rulership, man. He felt the authority with the austere spirits. You know, he felt the um, the influence, the ability. You know, that's power right there, man. You know, this is power. He felt the energy, the vi those vibrations. You know, this is power, man. We 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 on the highways and byways, man. This is power. You know, this thing is not to be taken lightly, you know, and it's being recognized. All right. So let me get uh, let me get the anointing. Let me get Numbers chapter six, verse 24. All right. It says I'm reading this is what was what the man had had mentioned. You know, it says this is Numbers chapter six, verse 24. The Lord bless thee and keep thee. The Lord make his face shine upon thee and be gracious unto thee. Because through grace, what we was able to repent. You know, and come and come into the fold. Take heed to the to the apostles and elders. You know, take heed to the order. Come under the true doctrine. You know, verse twenty, verse twenty six. The Lord lift up His countenance upon thee and give thee peace. Cause we only have we only have peace through the scriptures, man. We only comforted through these scriptures. Okay, but when when people say when we hear sayings like those those are such, hey, those are faith boosters, to us, man. No matter who you are, it doesn't matter if you was a little kid or an old man. It doesn't matter who it was, man. It's about the the context, man. It's about what's being said, not who said it, man. That's what that's why this word is so emotional because they so focused on being politically correct instead of being truthful. You know, people forgot how to be truthful, man. You know? Let me get uh let me read her um of course stated leave the picture up of course. This is Revelation chapter three, verse ten. It says, Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I will keep thee from the hour of temptation. Because the man said, may the Lord bless you and keep thee, you know, and keep you, you know, because hey, we try to remain in the truth. You know, that's what it's really about, remaining and enduring, you know, through all trials and experiences. That's a straight gate. Those those positions of difficulty, you know, but our power is being recognized, man. We hey, people can feel it. As soon as people walk by, it may it may frighten people. That's why they put their head down. They cross the street before they walk past the camp. You know, because our power is being recognized, man. They know we're not here to play. They know we're not here to play, man. <laughs> so I'm reading again, verse 10. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. So there's no running from what's about, to, what's about to conspire on this earth, man. Concentration camps, you know, swords being battled with the, on, the, on the outskirts, man, in these streets. It's about to be real in the, in the field, man. All right, people dying left and right, you know. But he's going to keep, you know, his his faithful servant from the hour of temptation, you know, for no difficult situations, man. It's it's going to still be difficult, but hey, we trying to live, you know. We trying to escape death. That's what we trying to do, you know. But he's he's with us, man, you know. And with sayings like that, you, that that shows you that he's that Yahweh Bashmi outside is dealing with us, man. All right, because ultimately it does come down to faith, man. Of course. All right. So this is Joshua chapter one, verse nine. Have not I commanded thee? Be strong and of a good courage. Be not afraid, neither be thou dismayed, for the Lord thy power is with thee whithersoever so, so thou goest. 
So wherever you at, man, the angels are encamped around them that fear him, man. You know, whether you see it or not. So he's he's around he's around us, man, because we fear Yahweh Bashim Yahushah in sincerity, you know, in charity. Okay, wherever we go, we and we 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 ain't gotta be afraid. We ain't gotta be worried about our next move. We ain't gotta be worried about what we gonna do when this happen, when that happen. Nah, nah, it ain't, it ain't gonna go like that, man. Hey, be strong and good courage. Of course, we use the wisdom with that with that strength and of good courage as well, you know. But we not fearful hearted, man. We not faint hearted. When times get rough, man, and we going we pray that Yahweh Bashmi Al Shah give us a spirit to endure to endure whatever he put in front of us. Alright. Cause our power is being recognized. Let me get uh Psalms chapter 91. Alright. Cause I had to, I now even reached out to bro. I was like, that's hey, that's what that's what he said. You know, it is powerful, you know. To me personally, you know. Okay. So this is Psalms chapter 91. Verse 15, and the brother even mentioned that, hey, the brother Yonakar even mentioned in the video, hey, he, he could be an Israelite, you know? Because people keep, people <laughs> get get this thing so misconstrued that this is a Black Lives Matter movement, Black Hebrew Israelite movement. No, man. All right? This thing is truly spiritual, okay? People can't even understand that. People can't fathom that, you know, because it's not for them. All right? Simple as that. All right, so this is Psalm chapter 91, verse 15. He shall call upon me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble. I will deliver him and honor him. Hey, because he's going to watch over us and keep us, man. That's when we need him most in that time of trouble. That's when he's going. That's when our. That's that's when his power is going to be recognized within us in that time, man. In that trouble, he's going to deliver us, you know. And that's that's glorifying him and us being glorified as well, you know. It's it's, it's like killing one, you know, uh, two birds with one stone. Basically, you're going to be glorified because you, you're a servant of Yahweh Bashem Yahshua. And of course, Yahweh Bashem Yahshua is going to be uh, glorified because you're giving glory. You know who did it. You know who got you out of that situation. You know, you're going to magnify the name of the Lord. All right. Verse 16, with long life will I satisfy him and show him my salvation. Because it's, it's all about being delivered. That's why we 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 we're trying we're 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 hoping to be delivered. That's the end goal of this thing, man. We're hoping to be delivered, and we see we see through these signs and these prophecies, you know what's going on. That we close, you know that we close, man. All right, you know, we're not saying we're gonna be delivered tomorrow or whatnot, but we're close. Okay, it's all it's all it's all the Lord's doing. It's it's in due time, in due season. Okay, whenever that time may be. But hey, our power is being recognized, you know, and our power and that, that with that being said, our power being recognized, that hey, that's the glorification of Yahweh Bashim Yahushah. Okay, the heavenly father in the son, who the world ignorantly calls as God and Jesus Christ. All right, other scriptures of the Holy Bible. All right. So I want to just put forth that uh, you know, those declaring words because power, hey, power and power is about to increase. You know, these things are about to increase, man. Okay. That's going to consist of us doing miracles, healings, you know, spiritual powers, you know, because it's already spiritual power to prophesy things to come before they happen. That's already spiritual power. You know, the brother Yonakar always said that. <laughs> All right. But I just wanted to point that out because hey, that was something, you know, that's something to point out, you know, through the spirit. I feel like that's something to point out and not just let, uh, you know, not pass on by. OK, because it was heavy. It's, it is heavy when you hear sayings like that because you don't hear them every camp. You don't hear them every time. You don't hear them every week, every month, you know? So, hey, to hear something as it takes power to be out here, you know, it, it, and um, may the Lord bless you and keep thee, you know, and keep you. Hey, those are comforting words, man, you know, and we don't take it lightly. You know, we appreciate them, you know, all right? Because people people think we just some aggressive, curse out, curse, cuss everybody out. Man, look, man, it's a balance, man. All right, is it? It's a time and place for time to love and time to hate, time for peace and time for war. That's what it is. Okay, so uh, no Lord Williams edifying is exhorting for the spirit. I right, went now by giving all the glory for praises unto Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai by Hashem Rakadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, teacher with wisdom, since time not go David. And with that, I want to say Shalom, a waffle ball, keep the faith, Shalom.